Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to change the background of your Wix website in 2023. Personalizing your website's background is a fantastic way to make your site stand out and showcase your unique style. So in this step-by-step -step guide, we'll walk you through the process of changing your website's back co background color or adding a captivating image to make it uh, uh, visual appealing. So let's dive right into it and let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience. So first, we'll have to go and sign in into our Wix account. To do so, go and open whatever browser we're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually going to use the Brave browser. And of course, in your case, you can use any other browser that you could possibly have. Once you open that browser, make sure to go to the CRL section and simply type wix.com and hit the enter button. That should take you to the home screen or main screen of Wix websites right away. Of course, if you uh, never like access the Wix website, you will not find yourself on this page. You'll find yourself in the home page. From there, you'll be able to log in into your account at the top right corner option. You will find here an option to sign in into your, your account or even create an account for yourself if it's your first time. And of course, uh, if you don't know much about Wix websites, you can scroll down, read more information about it, uh, familiarize yourself with Wix, so you will be good to go. Once you create your account or just log in into your account, you'll find yourself on the dashboard. Just go to my sites here. And of course, as I said, if it's your first time, you'll have to go and click on create a new site for yourself. Follow the steps that provided there to create a site for yourself. Once you do so, you'll be able now to access the Wix editor and from there we'll be able to change the background. So for me, I already have here plenty of websites, so I'm just going to click on the three dots and click on edit site or simply I can click on this icon of a pen or pencil uh, to access the Wix editor or editor of Wix. So now let's just wait for the page until it loads to show you how to change the background of course i'll be able to do that by opening like the background settings and changing the background color or image or whatever i want depending of course on whatever i feel like so as you can see that is my site at the moment what we will need to do of course is just simply go in to this list panel so as you can see from this list panel i'll be able to choose a lot of uh, or change a lot of stuff including the background so as you can see here i'll be able to add some elements on my sites here i'll be able to add sections add pages and menu edit the design uh, add some apps my business here and a lot of other stuff that will not need so go and click on site design once you do so as you can see you'll be able even to change the theme if you want to so if you click here as you can see you'll find a lot of themes so we have the site theme here and we find other themes that we can use you can go and check all of them as you can see whatever you like you can simply use it so as an example click on this and make sure to click on save and click on save and continue and as you can see now we have this as your size as an example so other than that if you like uh, don't want to change the theme or something like that uh, you want just to change the background of course let's just click on uh, sites design again and from here as you can see you will be able to access the page background Click on that, and as you can see, you'll be able to do like the background as a color if you want to. So we have here different colors. You can even add more colors from here. If you have the hex code of your uh, color, you can simply paste it here, or the RGB code of your color, or even is uh, HSP. You can simply or choose whatever suits you. So this is at the moment just the color of the header, and of course for you, let me just make it uh, white. And of course, you can change instead of color, you can choose an image. You can click on this image right here, and as you can see, you will find a lot of images here on the library. Or you can go and upload an image from your PC. So click on upload an image, as an example. I'm just going to upload here like the Amazon uh, logo, which is PNG. And of course, I can even use it as a background, as an example. So click on change background, and here you are. As you can see, you have it as a background. You can even access the settings of that background to change the image opacity. You can even choose the color behind the image as an example to change it however you want. And you can even, as an example, add some scroll effects. Do you want it to uh, have none uh, scroll effects or parallax or freeze, depending on whatever suits you. How the image scale fill or fits or tile or whatever you want. So do whatever suits you here. 
and of course this uh, as example i'm just going to list original size and where the the image position you can put it wherever you want an example so i'm just going to list it on the middle here and as i said you can even change the image opacity however you want so as an example i'll make it something like that why not and instead of image you can even go and make it a video so you can choose a video from here on the library or you can even go and add a video on your uh, pc again you can upload a media or a video you can even upload it if you want from wix from google drive facebook instagram dropbox google photos vimeo uh, Flickr, and as you can see a lot of other stuff including even the link or url of the video you can simply insert here and you'll be able to upload it here on your computer for me i already have a video here so let's say as an example choose this as the background as you can see, the video will be here at the background and I can access the settings always and it, I, w I can change, of course, the overlay pattern or I can make no pattern here and you can over enable this uh, overlay color and change, of course, the opacity and color of that. The play speed, I can make it like slow or I can make it fast or I can make it on normal. And of course, if you want to video to play once, make sure to disable this option. If you wanted to play uh, not uh, just uh, one time, Disable this option if you wanted to play many times and forever keep playing, make sure to enable this option. And now you can play as an example the video here and you will be able to see like your video is going through this. So at the moment, of course, I'm selecting the header. That's why uh, we're changing like the background of the header. Other than that example, we can even uh, change the background of other sections. For example, we can simply click on that section, click on change a stripe background. Of course, you can do the same do the color change the color of the background as an example i'm just going to list this with this color or add an image on on it as an example let's just do an image here on this wix uh, like a library as you can see you can make it as the image and you can of course even make a video even from here wix so from there you'll be able even to change or adjust that image or video or color depending on whatever you want so as an example here i can edit edit the image as you can see i can edit the brightness of it the contrast of it highlights uh, shadow color saturation and etc so temperature so you can do whatever you want with this of course if you're good with that you will make a definitely good background for your site and it's going to be attracting a lot of customers so you can even adjust like the sharpness widgets grain tint i don't know what i'm doing actually here so i'm just going to save this and let's see how it's going to show in the background here and of course if you are not satisfied with your changes you can always click on revert to original and it will come back to the original uh, image as, as it was so you can see this is the image of the background as you can see and you can even make as a video however you want and once you're done, make sure to save everything, publish your uh, site, before, uh, but before make sure to preview it on the desktop and phone and publish it and you will be good to go with this website right here. So if you reach the sponsor of this video, congratulations, uh, you've now mastered the art of changing the background of your Wix website. So if you liked the video, make sure to leave a like down below, subscribe for our channel for more helpful tutorials like this one, and I'll see you in the next video.